This is a Porsche Panamera hybrid. It has a, a battery issue, so we can do a scan. I'm gonna click on the EOBD. Auto scan. And as you see, we have the uh, P0A80 error code, and it says replace hybrid battery. So we can look at that code. So here is uh, Mr. Nidal, the owner of uh, We Care Shop. I have a question for you, Mr. Nidal. Yes, sir. What is the future of uh, auto repair? Ah, well, hello everyone. The future of auto repair, you see it right here. Everything is batteries, everything's electric. So, uh, Mr. Nidal, what's wrong with this battery here? This battery just was not holding charge. Uh, we couldn't figure it out. There's not much information out there. So we reached out to Steam Tech. Mr. Thank you. He came in. Um, he was able to figure everything out, and now he's actually training us. So we will be offering such service. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Nidal. Away from the shop, I'm going to be configuring and testing um, this charger. This charger uh, do lithium polymer, lithium ion, life, lithium high voltage, nickel metal hydride, nickel carbide, and uh, lead batteries. So I'll be using this battery here, this uh, 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 charger to uh, charge our Porsche Panamera uh, modules. For that reason, we go to lithium iron select we're going to be doing balancing and charging so since uh, i'm not balancing right now i'm just going to go to charge mode it's one s the capacity of each cell we have in the uh, porsche is uh, 24 amp hour, but for this cell, uh, it's rated at 1500 milliampere hour. So I can uh, change that. It's one S. Increment this to 1500 milliampere and start charging. Battery check. Enter to confirm, it's charging. This battery is already charged, so this is just for testing purpose. Everything looks good. This is basically um, the voltage. We're charging it at 0 0.6 ampere. This represents the time, and this is how much uh, and hours pumped into the uh, the cell. Now we're gonna go back to the shop and apply this to each model. And
and look at and see the results. So this is the uh, Porsche Panamera uh, hybrid battery. Uh, we have uh, basically bottom and top. On the bottom, there are like four modules. Each module contains 13 cells. And top, similar thing. We have four models, and each module contains 13 cells. So uh, we collected measurements. Uh, for all these eight, uh, eight uh, modules, and again, uh, each model contains 13 cells, so there are a total of 104 cells. The, va the initial measurement shows uh, there is no issues with the cells. They all have three, almost 3.5 volts. Uh, we will be charging them, make sure that actually they can be charged. Uh, the models, they are all good. Uh, and this is the uh, total voltage of each model. So we're good, top and bottom. So the next step is to charge, use our charger, and basically uh, try to charge separate models. So th this is the uh, model or representation of a model of uh, Porsche Panamera. So there are 13 cells in series, so they're connected like this. We have plus, minus, positive, negative, going all the way like that. So these values represent uh, the voltage of each cell, okay? So based on first analysis, uh, all the models are fine. There is no issue with the low voltage. Um, I'm thinking uh, that the problem is not the, the cell or the model themselves but it's something with the, uh, uh, the connection. The, these models are not being charged. The problem that we care auto have is uh, an issue with the connection. So the control unit is not charging these cells when they, are, when they need to be charged, basically. So see you in a later video. Thank you.